Hello friends, welcome to the Breaking News 247 channel, in this video I would like to send you the following content, if there were ever a time to join us, it is now. Every contribution, however big or small, powers our journalism and sustains our future. Unemployed father, boy does Yvette win second place in European tennis competition. Vedant no one was the only player in the elite field of 14 boys, aged 10 and under, who had traveled to Croatia's resort town of Umag without a coach. But the young Indian tennis player made light of his torn shoes to leave all but one of the competition behind, finishing runner-up in the Champions Bowl World Finals. Vedant qualified for the meet, Europe's prestigious U10 event, by winning regional and national meets in Spain, where he trains. The 10-year-old lost to Greece's Rafael Paganis, with whom he won the doubles title. The fifth grader trains under Daniel Kieran at Soto Tennis Academy in Soto Grande and is a regular on the Spanish circuit, where trainees at world's best academies compete. The family moved to Spain after his father, a pilot, lost his job. While rankings for that most formative of age groups, the under-10 section, is strongly discouraged, where Vedin stands among his peers may be garnered from his triumph in the national competition in Spain which helped him qualify for UMEG. The other players in UMEG also came through a similar two-tier event staged in their respective countries. Parents made bold choices. Vedin, a left-hander, is training abroad courtesy of some bold decisions made by his parents. The Moans, Anisha and DHRUV, from defense backgrounds, had reached out to renowned international coaches to assess Vedin's talent. Among them was the John McEnroe Tennis Academy in New York, who also elicited an interest in training the boy. They decided on the Soto Tennis Academy 13 months ago, deciding to shift from Muscat, where they were based, on the very day DHRUV, a commercial pilot, got the pink slip in the midst of a raging pandemic. Without a job, and savings that would at best keep them going for a few months, the family of four arrived in Spain, where stringent labor laws prohibit foreign nationals, unless authorized, from even waiting tables. They've managed to get by so far with borrowings from parents and siblings, but it'll only get tougher from here as Theo Kiernan, a former pro, and the director of the Soto Tennis Academy, thousands of euros, and counting. Thank you for watching our videos, subscribe to our channel to get notifications when we post newest videos. Thank you and goodbye!